there, my name is Shell. I'm a deck officer aboard the schooner Harvey Gammage, and I would like to show you around the ship a bit, so why don't you follow me? So now that I've come down the companionway ladder, I want to show you the galley, which is what we call a kitchen on board a ship. Um, so it's basically what you would expect out of your kitchen at home, but we have to secure things for sea a little bit better. So if you check out our stove here, it has a stove top as you would expect with the oven down below, but there's these nice fiddles that keep everything in place when the waves are rocking the ship. Same with our knives tucked in here and all of the rails around the galley. And we can cook everything you can at home like a batch of cookies or lasagna or baked breads or whatever the cook has in mind for us that day. And on the stovetop, of course, we can make mac and cheese and boil water. So we have hot water for hot cocoa and coffee. So now that you've seen the galley where we prepare our food, I want to show you the salon, which is where we go about eating our food amongst other activities. Um, so if you check out the table right here, if there's heavy weather up on deck and we can't eat up on deck, students and crew together will come down um, and take a seat at the benches on either side, starboard or port table here. Um, and we can enjoy meals together. We also have a refrigerator and a freezer for all of our food stores, in addition to all of these benches being tucked full with food as well. Um, and outside of meal times, we also use this communal space for doing things like studying, right? Your, your navigation and weather. Um, we're picking up a book and having it with some tea. It's just a, a space for us to share. All right, I want to welcome you guys back up on deck here to talk a little bit about what makes Harvey Gamage as a traditional schooner so special. And part of that is this amazing rigging here, these wooden spars and sails and all of the lines that you see aloft that make this happen. So the thing about uh, Harvey Gamage being a traditional schooner is that we have to do everything on board manually. We don't have winches or machines to do it for us. We use our own machines <laughs> on board and together collectively as a crew, we will hoist this gaff here on the mainsail all the way up aloft to the top of the main. So as much as I'd love to talk to you trainees about the fun of sailing and sail training all day, uh, for the parents, I'd like to also mention safety on board Harvey Gamage. So we have lots of life-saving equipment on board, like for example, ah, life rings and life rafts. As a U.S. Coast Guard certificated vessel, we have all the required safety equipment for taking you on a voyage at sea. Now we're going to take you down below decks to show you where you live on board because you will indeed be living on the ship. This will be your home just like it's the cruise home and you're going to sleep down here in the forward compartment. So why don't we show you down there? Welcome down below to the forward compartment. Here I want to show you where you're going to be living, sleeping on board Harvey Gamage. So if you take a look to my left here, or forward on the ship, here's a set of bunks, um, student bunks. So one person will be sleeping down here and another up on the top bunk. Every bunk has a privacy curtain that you can draw to show your shipmates that you are asleep and that is your own personal space. Um, you have storage below the bunk as well in these compartments um, and shelves up by your head. So these are only two bunks, but Harvey Gamage actually sleeps 39 folks in total, including trainees and crew. Um, so if you take a look, you can just see the numbers down here. This forward compartment houses 18 students in total, um, but there are other compartments on the ship with more bunks. Thank you so much for coming aboard and taking a tour with us today. We're really excited for you to actually come join us as crew. Uh, but for now, I've got to get back to work, because the ship's work never ends. On your head!